course there is kind of the sky's the limit um, is where we'd like to be um, but I know last year they raised around that four to five thousand dollar range and we'd like to see that um, increased for this school year absolutely I think anytime that we can do two things one is that truly raising money for an organization that's benefiting uh, families or benefiting kids and second though is um, raising awareness about the needs of people out there um, my favorite dress up day is any day that I can get away with wearing sweatpants. So pajama day, girl outfit day, as well as the color day for excellent. You know, basketball show games, it's fun, although I did hurt my back a little bit, put my heart out. At the end of the day, it's really about uh, the grit that you put towards the game, and the game changed my life as a young man. Yeah, I was, yeah, I was looking forward to it. Good time. So, uh, we had a good staff crew together, so that was nice. I like flannel, fr oh well not Friday, flannel, uh, flannel day yesterday was good, um, I think a lot of people have flannel and the, a lot, I know a lot of the staff are taking part in it as well, so it's a good one. I thought the Pep Fest went great, uh, we raised over $650 and I think we've got uh, a really good week ahead of us. I think my favorite dress up day would have been the neon day. Because, you know, I don't know why. Because when it's crummy outside, it's nice to have neon colors to make us feel bright and cheery. Oh, it's like very like fun to like dress up and all that. So yeah, Perfect. I find it like a very hype experience. People like competing against each other and like having actually like the drive because they want to win. Yeah, I thought the events were fun. I didn't get to participate in them, but I heard students talking about them a lot in class, and then I know a lot of teachers that that were there. So. Yeah, I think the basketball, pickleball specifically, were really good ideas. 